Well, they looked at the fluid for a long time. What do you think? Not yet. But I was still thinking lymph gland cancer or some sort of infection. On January 17th. I'll tell him. Dr. Wright called to say he still didn't know what I had, but that he couldn't rule out the big C. Mm -hmm. When he heard that, we were sad, and we went out to dinner, and his favorite dinner was sushi. So we sat for a while and just talked and just prepared for whatever the next steps would be. We were both devastated. I didn't know how to make things better, and that was what I did best. I knew I had to tell my parents, cancer isn't something that you can hide. The doctor's pretty sure I have lung cancer. It was a shock, certainly. It seemed impossible. Let's stay positive. You just never think about it. Someone dying when they're that young. They looked at the fluid for a long time, and they kept seeing some unusual debris or features. Well, they couldn't really quite figure out what it was. So they spent a lot of time looking, and they said, we don't see anything that looks like cancer. Well, there, there's something there. Then, on January 20th, 2008, someone on Dr. Wright's team found something strange, a possible answer to my mystery. We thought, at this point, we should probably get an infectious disease specialist involved. David, it's Robert. And Dr. Fisk, who's an excellent infectious disease specialist, was available, and he got involved. This was an exceptionally unusual situation. This was something that I had never seen before. When I've looked under the microscope in someone's lung fluid in my career, this is a first for me. Dr. Wright called us in to share what they'd found. I'd never been more nervous. It's not cancer. <sighs> but there is something else. As I recall, the good news is that it doesn't look like he has got uh, anything that's malignant, but there is some concerning news that he's got uh, uh, an unusual infection. And this infection perfectly explained all of my symptoms. The difficulty breathing, the weakness, coughing up the blood, and the liters of fluid they took from my lung. They were all caused by something shocking. Eggs. These are worm eggs. What do you mean? Eggs. We know that it's parasitic infection. I couldn't believe it. There were live, active organisms growing in my chest cavity. 